of, of, of you know, the denominations and quote and all mm. that. that okay. That's man doing that stuff. That's right. not God, you know. And so that type of stuff, people today are, are they're almost afraid of organized religion, so to speak, mm. because it just seems like a way to be trying to control people. And we need to give the, the, the spirit of God, the heart mm. of God, okay. the pulse of God. And that may not always come out in a way Mm. You know, I know I know I can say this for sure because I've talked to other artists. Right. We get more resistance from the body of Christ mm -hmm. with this genre of music and the way we go about then, things than right. we do in the world. That's and right. that's not supposed to be. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's not supposed to be. We're supposed to be able to look to pastors, mm -hmm. community leaders or whatever and say, this is who we are. Mm -hmm. This is what we're about. Help us give us a platform so that we can right. go after the people. And, and you almost get them thinking, well, we're trying to copy or imitate the world. And it's like, that's not it. Mm. That's not it. I mean, this is who God has made us, so help us with that. Mm. So you're going to hear a lot of that okay. literally come through the music. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, one song okay. that I'm writing is um, called Inner City. As a mm. matter of fact, uh, Juma's the producer on there. Okay. Produced the hot track. Mm. And, uh, and, and it's, it's literally talking about... When I wrote in a city, I was actually born in the city, you know, Franklin Hill, you know, in right. the projects. And I'm writing this song through the eyes of someone who lives in the inner city. Okay. The everyday struggle. Okay. The, so sort of a different perspective on it. Yeah, and right. it, and it, and it, and it's it's getting at the church, mm. you know, where where. You know, the church talks about this, that, and the other, and, and, and but yet yeah, we're telling kids they can't come mm -hmm. in the church because they have piercings or tats or mm -hmm. this, that, and the other, and that's not supposed to be, right. you know, and, and yet, you know, we see pastors prospering and all of that, and that's all well and good. I'm, <laughs> mm -hmm. I'm, I'm down with that, but okay, what about just the everyday mm -hmm. young man or young woman right. trying to come up, trying to grow up in the inner city, facing mm -hmm. life, facing struggles and whatnot? What are we doing to, to reach out, okay. you know, and to show love? Okay. So you hear a lot of that coming through mm. the music. Okay. You know, a lot of that coming through the music. So I'm excited. I'm, I'm definitely looking forward yeah. to hearing that. So. I'm excited. <laughs> so you have any kind of maybe love songs or stuff like that? Not really? Um, <laughs> yeah. 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 I, I, it'll be balanced. <laughs> it, it'll, it'll definitely right. be balanced. I won't be uh, an angry rapper. <laughs> <laughs> I won't be an angry artist. It, it'll okay. definitely be balanced. I, I mm -hmm. definitely foresee um, a song specifically shouting out to young ladies because okay. young ladies, um, and, and, and young men do it too, but sometimes we look for love in the wrong places. All the time. And you know, All the we, time. And, we, and, yeah. and you, know, you give of yourself certain ways, and mm -hmm. you, you know, a, a young man is good for coming up to a young lady and saying what he knows how to say mm -hmm. to get his way with her. <laughs> and talk her mm. literally out of everything that has been taught to her and shown right. her over the years. But I realize, you know what, that young lady's looking for love. Yeah. Um, and the personal challenge again is because I have a daughter. Mm -hmm. You know, my daughter's <laughs> 13 going on 14. And so it's like, okay, you know, both sides of this thing, Lamar. You know, you mm -hmm. were that young man growing up yeah. that had crazy boundary struggles. And oh, yeah. <laughs> you, you see what I'm saying? So yeah. it's like, okay, God, I'm... This this is personal. You have a right. unique perspective on yeah. things to be able to. Oh, yeah. that, that's that's really cool. You know what I mean? Okay. It's it's you know, and so that's that's the deal with that. All right. Also, so what's this project called? Are you gonna tell us that, or you want I'm us to? I'm not gonna tell. Well, and, and, and <laughs> you know what? And it's not even that I don't want to tell because <laughs> I don't want people to know. I'm just kind of tossed between. A Still couple working of, yeah, things out. Yeah, I'm, okay. I'm tossed between All a couple right. of things. Okay. I started off calling it Seasons Change mm -hmm. because that's personal to me because mm -hmm. I have gone through some serious changes, mm. you know, over the seasons. Okay. Uh, on, you know, family, life, money, ministry, mm. what have you. Uh, but then I wrestle back and forth. Uh, with a couple of things, I you know I thought about the name Filthy Garments, mm. you know, <laughs> coming out of the book of um, I want to say Zechariah. Okay. Um, you know, just some prophetic stuff right. going on there, and so I'm um, you know I'm throwing some things okay. out. I will be patient. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So so do you have a time frame you're aiming for this? Time frame, still... you know. Yeah. Last time I was okay. here, I wanted to release it last year, but mm -hmm. I feel like sometimes. When you put a time frame on things, then mm. you may start rushing. Right, okay. And people haven't heard from me in a while, so they need to hear from me. Okay. And I want them to hear here. And so okay. 
I'd love to say I'm gonna release it this year. Okay. Um, which is which is very realistic. Mm. Um, but I'm gonna take my time. Okay. I'm gonna take my time. Okay. You know. All right. Cool. Awesome. Oh, well, it's been fantastic having you in here. I wish we could get you in like every week or something. Yeah. <laughs> that would be awesome. I love awesome. being here. Love talking <laughs> with you all. So where can uh, just give us uh, your website, Twitter, Facebook. All of that. Yeah, hit stuff. me up on Facebook. Just okay. you know, hitting Lamar Callahan. Mm. Uh, website's lamarcallahan.com. Okay. And uh, if y'all want to just drop me an email, uh, Lamar dot Callahan at gmail dot com. Okay. And um, you know, booking events and, and stuff like that. And, okay. Uh, yep, have some things coming up, heading up to Maine, and awesome. Yeah, and some local things, and so uh, you know. So you'll be, be on, you'll be around. You'll be on I'll the be scene. I'll be around. All I'll right. Be, I'm, I, I'm around. <laughs> Y'all pray for me all right, we'll do. <laughs> as we continue this grind, you know? Cool. Thank you so much again Thank for coming you for through. And me. we'll hope to have you back in here yeah. sooner than later. All right. Cool. And, uh, repping the Bruins. Uh, all right, <laughs> you're going to be rocking your Celtics jersey Celtics. tomorrow. <laughs> all right, yeah, yeah. So, so you've been watching The Green Room with your host, Ima, and our brother, Lamar. We'll be right back. Stay tuned.